They're also tracking breaking news on a deadly car crash in spring. KPRC 2's Devin Clark just arrived at the scene a few minutes ago and joins us live now. What can you tell us, Devin? Jacob, we know that a car, a Tesla, was traveling here in this subdivision, the Carlton Wood subdivision here near the Woodlands, and it actually burst into flames after crashing into a tree. The scene is now clear, but I want to show you the tire marks here left in the grass that lead right up to this tree where the car crashed. We understand that there was a person in the passenger seat in the front of the car and then in the passenger seat in the rear of the car. It might have been an automatic driving mode. We're not exactly sure, but we do know that two males are dead as a result of this crash. And when firefighters got here, they say they had to use 23 thousand gallons of water to extinguish the flames because of the car's batteries that kept reigniting. We know that Harris County Constable Precinct 4's office is leading the investigation and they're trying to determine exactly what happened here but we do know that the vehicle was traveling from the cul-de-sac on hammock dunes place and failed to negotiate the curve slamming into the tree bursting into flames both victims transported to the harris county forensics autopsy center for an autopsy and identification. We're not exactly sure who those men are, but we do know that they've both passed away as a result of injuries sustained in this crash. Again, two men died as a result of this Tesla driving here and crashing into this tree. We're going to have more information as more details become available. But for now, reporting live in spring, Devin Clark, KPRC 2 News. Devin, thank you, man.